turn. No! I'm okay! Go! What took you so long? You. What are you doing here? Forget it. I don't have time for this. And neither do I. So I'll cut to the chase. I'm here for the sword. Your point being... Hmm. It was originally my brother's. Return it to me, and I'll let you go, kid. That's a pretty pink when I kick your ass! Oh, for it. Take a tip from the elders. I'll take that. Dante. I'm gonna go too. Why don't you sit this one out? Oh, that you call me dead weight again? No thanks. I've got all the power I need. Right here. You don't understand. It's not what I mean. <laughs> Let him go, Dante. Time is a luxury that we can no longer afford. We must chase after him post haste. What? Does that mean you're going to? I have a duty to see this through. Well, that's all you had to say, Mr. Poetry. I'm gonna go my way, and you guys can go yours. Let's just say that's the best for the cause. How are you holding out? I'm fine. You should get back to your friends. Now they're gone. Back to the Earth 3000. From now on, it's just you and me. So your friends abandoned you, huh? Well, I told you. I work alone. Uh, uh, uh. What is it with you? For years, I've tried to be your friend. But you don't want anything to do with me. My friend. You don't even know the first thing about me, Wes. I had nothing. I was dirt poor. And I have struggled for as long as I can remember to pull my life out of the gutter. No one helped me. Not even for one minute. Unlike you, who's had everything handed to him on a silver platter. You and I have nothing in common. No. 
We may have grown up differently, but we have a lot in common. We both fought to change our destinies, and we both succeeded. Look at this. We are Power Rangers, Eric. And friends or not, we're the only hope this city has right now. Let's do it. You got some pretty big cojones for coming back. Just don't know when to give up! Get out of my way, Nero!
And defeating me like this has no meaning. Come on, Virgil. Let's do this. Heal your wounds, Dante. Get strong. After that, we'll settle the matter. <laughs> Just a legend. The dagger. It controls the Rhino Nexus. You see, in the jungle of spirits, there's this massive tree. And at the top, the powers of the Rhino. Now, without the dagger, no one gets through. But if you have the dagger, you're sweet. You go straight in. That's the legend, anyway. And I possess the spirit of the Rhino. So unlocking the powers of the Rhino is my destiny. So, where is the dagger? Oh, don't worry. I keep it in a very, very safe place. I'll be back. Maybe I'll just go with you. Seek it! Dante, it really is you? You don't remember me? No. How much of your childhood do you remember? Uh, not much. I had meningitis when I was seven. Why my memory? Why? <laughs> they told me I had a car accident that resulted in total amnesia. Age? Seven. Your point? Well, meningitis is a human affliction. You are not human, Dante. All war is fought with deception, and you have been deceived. Your past has been hidden from you for a reason. Rewind a bit. Who are you again? My name is Virgil. I established the order to help find a way to fight the demons. Besides swords and bullets, you mean? Such weapons can win battles, but not the war. We use force, yes, but... We also use intelligence, politics, propaganda. You really believe you can make a dent? Make a dent? With the two of us working together, I believe that we can defeat them. So that's what this is about. You need me to fight the demons, help you save the world. What else were you planning on doing with your life? Oh, you guys do seem really nice, but uh, I'm more of a loner type. Trust issues, work alone, that kind of thing. Dante, I don't think you understand what is at stake. If you want to leave, turn your back on me. I'm powerless to stop you. But you'll be making a grave mistake. Not just for yourself, but for mankind. For mankind? Yes. What makes you think I give a shit? At least give me a chance to show you. Show me what? Who you really are. Limbo has collapsed into the real world. What was once hidden is now laid bare for all to see. Revolution is in the air. I never believed I'd live to see this day. Just the beginning of the end for the demons. Mankind would be free. Yes. Free from the demons. The path is clear for us to rule. What did you just say? The path is clear for us to rule. To rule what? This. Everything. Virgil. You mean like Mundus? No. No. We'll be nothing like Mundus. We'll respect our subjects, not enslave them. Subjects? He means you. He means humans. I thought we were fighting for freedom. 
It was his freedom we were fighting for, not yours. Don't be so simplistic. Humans are frail. They're like children. They need protection. Not just from others, but from themselves. We, you and I, have saved them. You and I saved them? Who else? A human. Cat was useful, but... Useful? Cat saved my life. Cat held out under torture to keep your existence a secret. Cat led us through the tower to Mundus' lair. We would have failed 20 times over if it weren't for her. Listen. If you can't see the chaos that humans will cause, if you don't want the responsibility of protecting them, then stand aside. I'll rule alone. I didn't help you destroy Mundus so that you could take his place. I can't let you do this, Virgil. And I can't let you stop me, brother. Stand. Aside. Don't do this. Rachel, please. Stay out of this!